in every instance, there's an alternative to what has been going on. Why don't we take that alternative? It simply can't be true of us that we're predisposed to war. With all of the kind of time that's passed, with all of the energy, with all of the human ingenuity, so little has changed. We can't be An artist is basically on the front line, fighting negative forces, trying to create a better world. It raises a consciousness which says, I know you saw that, now what? The Victorian State Library offered me a fellowship. This gave me an opportunity to create a work about peace on a monumental scale. It has allowed me to acknowledge those whose work has been an influence on me. I've worked with artists in a number of places, collaborated with them, who've been involved in conflict and experienced it. I think individual works of art can have a, a, a trigger effect. It can just shift enough perceptions for the ultimate destination to be very, very different from how things were moving in the first place. Bullets are fired based on how we see one another. And it's recognizing that common humanity in people who we consider our enemies. I think as an artist, you really have to kind of challenge those boundaries and lead people. Although a painting will never stop a bullet, a painting can stop a bullet from being fired. It can influence people to think differently about their world.